In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the quick unboxing and a complete setup of your Xerox B230 laser printer. Let's do the unboxing. So here we can see it comes with the power cable and that's a small manual. Take the printer out of this plastic packaging. Inside we can see there is a manual and a drive to download the drivers. Remove the protective tape. Also from the back. Go to the back. Remove the tape from here. Next step is to plug in the power cable, so it goes at the back of the printer. So paper tray is here, you can slide it out completely, remove the protective tape. Place the letter size or refer size paper here. You can adjust the size. It will stay like this. Now close the paper tray. Next step is to open the front ink chamber. Take the ink toner out. Slide it out from here. Now we have to remove the seal. You will see ink toner is sealed here. So press this button. It will remove the ink toner from here and now we have to open this seal so just take it off also we have to activate the ink toner so for that just take it out from this end next step is to just place it back inside so place it here like this it slides in and then it locks here now place it back inside so let it go like this once it is installed properly close this section switch on your printer press the power button printer is ready so we have to start the setup select your language and press ok next step is to do the security setup you can add the pin number or we can just skip it select your country of residence from here and then press ok select your time zone and press ok again select correct date and time Next step is to connect your printer to the wireless network. So click yes. Set up on printer. Yes, we want to set up on the printer. On the next screen, click on the choose network. It will search for the Wi-Fi networks. 
Now select your network. You can scroll ahead. It will display the names. Select it. Now enter the password. For that you, again you can use this button. For digits, for alphabets, you can scroll back or you can sc scroll ahead like after 90A and with OK button you can enter it. Press OK button to apply the password. Okay. Printer is connected to the Wi-Fi. Press. Printer is connected and we are ready to use it over the Wi-Fi. For that we have to add this printer in our smartphone, laptop or Macbook. Now go to your smartphone. Go to the app store. Download Xerox Easy Assist app. Open this app. Select connect to existing printer. Allow. It will display your Xerox B230 printer. Select it. So printer is ready and we have successfully installed it. Click continue. Continue. You can skip it if you want to set up on the computer or macbook you can do it later and click continue now we can start using it for printing so let's do a test print click on the print let's see the printing speed So that's the complete setup of the printer and we can start using it for wireless printing using a smartphone. Now I'm going to show you how to add the printer in your Windows laptop. Go to the laptop screen. Go to the web browser and type in Xerox B230 driver. It will take you to the Xerox website. Now click on the downloads. If you scroll down you will see your printer. In the drivers and download section, it will automatically detect your windows. Scroll down, agree with the terms and conditions and download the driver. Open file, click yes. That's the download window. Click on the agree. You will see your printer that is here. So click on the quick install. Because your printer is online, so automatically it shows up here. And that makes the setup easy. Installation is complete. If you want you can register your printer. Just to check click on the print a test page. That is the Windows printer test page. So we have successfully installed our printer in our Windows laptop. Click on the done, close all the windows and we can start using this printer for wireless printing using your laptop. For example to print a page I can double click on it, click on the print, scroll down and look for your Xerox printer and click on the print. So you can see it is working, so printer is working and it is completely installed. In case you have a CD drive or DVD drive, you can just use this drive and download the drivers directly. Otherwise you have to just go to the Xerox website and you can download from there. Now this printer is a Wi-Fi printer. You can also use it with the USB cable. So if you want to know how to do that, you can watch my video on that. 
Also, you can use the Ethernet cable with this printer with the LAN wire. And there are different settings you can do from the printer display panel. That's all about this printer. Thanks for watching.